with unique apps. Today, we've got an awesome video where we're going to showcase the top five apps from this past week. This video is brought to you by EverTap. Visit them at evertap.com. Put the links down in the description. You can download a bunch of fun games for your iPhone, iPod Touch, and iPad. And don't forget to check out their new Mahjong app just released this past Friday. Let's get on to the top five apps from this past week. Coming in at number one on this week's top app list is Gravity Lab. Navigate gravity shifts, bounce pads, portals, cannons, and more in this easy to play, difficult to master puzzle game. This game is totally awesome. Not only are the graphics great and crisp, but the gameplay is awesome. I've gone through a good 10, 20 of these levels, and let me say, this is a challenging yet addicting game. There's over 200 levels, including extra new challenges, bonus mini games, realistic physics. The developers of this app have gone the extra mile to make this both so challenging, but yet still addicting. I go back hour after hour to try to beat previous scores and the new levels. Check it out, Gravity Lab made by Mobile Snap. Coming in at number two on the top app list this week is Two Dots by Betaworks One. Join two brave dots as they traverse Arctic tundras, navigate fiery jungles, and plunge into ocean depths. Sharpen your skills across the 85 challenging levels while uncovering many exciting features along the way. This app is so addicting, I could not stop playing it while recording the video. Seems so simple to connect two or more dots together to make a pair, yet so difficult to try to reach the goal set by the game developers at the top of the screen. Learn different maneuvers along the way to help you improve your score and reach the goals. Check out Two Dots Today by Betaworks One. Coming in at number three this week on the top app list is The Line by Ketchup. Swipe your finger left or right to move the blue dot and stay within the line. I will admit I suck at this game just as bad as I suck at Flappy Bird, yet it's so addicting. I try to beat my score over and over, and yet I think my highest score now is under 80 still. But this game, seriously, don't let it fool you guys. It is hard and it is addicting. Coming in at number four this week is Final Kick, the best penalty shootout. Enjoy the tense moments of the penalty shots as if you were playing in the World Cup Final, competing against the best teams, making the most spectacular goals and saves, along with the best graphics you can get on the iPhone, iPad, and iPod Touch. Simple and intuitive controls help you kick and decide which direction to kick and how to block your goal against other players around the world. This is a real-time multiplayer game and hands down one of the best games I have ever played. Check it out. Final Kick, the best penalty shootout on iTunes today. Last but not least, coming in at number five on the top best apps this week is Avidity Blade 2, iTunes app of the week this past week. The God King has been defeated, and unlikely a hero has emerged, and now you must discover the truth behind secrets of the Infinity Blade. This app has some of the best graphics you've ever seen. Everybody knows about this app. It's got a four-star review of 49,357 ratings right now. All versions total over 144,000 ratings at a four star review level. This game is awesome. If you haven't downloaded this, you need to go check it out. The graphics are great. You constantly are swinging swords at villains, moving on through the level. If you're looking for a 3D fighting game, this is it. Go check it out on iTunes. It's Infinity Blade. It's in the top app charts. It's iTunes app of the week. Get it today. Hey everybody, hope you enjoyed our top app list this week. Be sure to check all the games out. I've included all the links down below, so grab them all on iTunes. And don't forget to check out our sponsor for this video today, evertap.com. Tons of free apps, tons of fun apps. Get them while they last. See you next week.